Hey. Hey, you. Yes, I'm talking to you. Yes, I'm the voice inside your head. Yes, it's me, the voice inside your head. Put that bowl of cereal down. We have some arts and crafts to do. Don't look at me like I'm stupid. Girl, you know ain't nothing left in there, just a bunch of milk. Put that down. These folks don't have time for this. We have some arts and crafts to do. Uh, man, you so hard-headed. Ain't nothing left in there. Are you a dog? Are you a cat? A dog and a cat, whichever one. Girl, put that thing down. Let's show them some snowflakes. All right. You have uh, everything you need? Mm-hmm. All the supplies. All right. All right. Wait. What? Where are you going? Hey, get back here. Where are you going? Oh, boy. Oh, you're back. You... What? Oh, dorky McDork Dork. All right. I guess you're ready for some Christmas winter arts and crafts now that you have your hat. All right. Let's show the folks what we have. First, you need popsicle sticks. Yes. Yes. Small or big ones. Next, you need a hot glue gun. Make sure it's plugged. Next, extra hot glue sticks. You also need some paint when you're all done. Paint your snowflakes. Uh, turn that around. It's upside down. Stupid. Yes. You need your paintbrushes and something to put your paint in. And some glitter to make it sparkle. I think we have everything we need. Are you ready? All right. Let's get started. Uh, okay, all right, all right. Yeah, you cute, you cute. Okay, everyone. You are going to start by hot gluing two popsicle sticks together. It really doesn't matter how you start, but just know that you're gonna, the base is gonna be six popsicle sticks. All righty. Oh, oh, hey, stay, stay, hot glue gun. So, yes, you are about to use six popsicle sticks hey hey stay focused put the tongue back in all right and that is going to start your star so the next two kind of lay out just diagonal from each other and you are going to put the hot glue gun pretty much in the middle of the two you really don't need a lot of hot glue um, just because it dries so quickly and it's, you know, strong for these little popsicle sticks. But for these two to kind of equally stay in the middle, I just put a lot of hot glue. Very wasteful. I know. I know. Where are you going? God, this girl is always going to places. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. She's not going anywhere. She decided to be smart and move the hot glue gun to her right side. <laughs> because, yes, she is right-handed. Now you're thinking, Ashley. Now you're thinking. Okay. I see. You left to grab the speaker. Of course. We want to jazzy up this moment with some great Christmas tunes. Come on back. Come on back. Now let's finish now we're our cooking. base for our snowflake. Now you are going to flip it over because it's too much on the front. So let's flip it over. Yes, that's how it looks now. And you are going to do the same thing to the other side. Add two more. Yep, diagonal from each other. Hey, girl, what you doing? You ain't no gangster. Put down the hot glue gun. Put it down. Girl. All right. Now you have finished. Let's take away the little spider webs from the hot glue gun. Yes, yes. You are done. Make sure it is glue secure. Okay. It's looking a little funky. 
see it looks like that big old gap in the way it looks like you can add another piece if you wanted to but um the hot glue is really easy really easy to use really easy to break apart once it's dry so yeah see i'm in your mind but you're reading my mind we're just gonna redo it and adjust it because it's really easy kind of to rip it off yep and we're just gonna put it just like that Okay, so now the next step is to take two more popsicle sticks. We're gonna make triangles at the end of each tip. So you notice how I put my hot glue gun at the bottom, and now I'm putting it on one of the popsicle sticks that I'm gonna make a triangle with on one side because they're all gonna connect. Put one down. Make a triangle and glue it at the top. And it's all really simple, but sometimes one point in your snowflake, you know, might be smaller or might be bigger than the others. It just really depends on where you lay them down. It really depends on your base, you know, if they were all even all six uh of your sticks but it's okay i mean it, it i think in the end it all turns out great anyway no matter if maybe one like triangle is bigger than the other because it all turns out and it's just the season that just kind of makes everything okay no matter how ugly your snowflake is Looks like the last side is in place. You did it, girlfriend. Yay, hey, 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 turn it up. You did it. You are officially done with your snowflake. So next is going to probably be the painting. Yay, you did it. You're all done. Look at that pretty snowflake, and it didn't even take that long either. All done. So now, move on to the paint. And those are just extra popsicle sticks that I thought I needed for some reason. Okay, let's get ready. Yes, your white paint. Uh-oh. Doesn't look like we have a lot. Let's see. Because... It really would look nice, um, all the snowflakes that I've done in the past, especially at work with the kids that I work with for an art project. White, I think, looks the best on the snowflakes. But as you can see, we've used all the white. So we are going to just do blue, which was our backup, Ashley and I. You know, Ashley's voice inside her head. So we're 
going to paint the snowflake blue. Um, but paint is really, really messy, and I didn't want to mess up my desk, even though I do use it for arts and crafts and things. I went to go grab some paper towel. Actually, the voice in my head told me to grab some paper towel because that would be the smart thing to do. Okay, voice. Go back to the regular Ashley voice. So now I'm going to paint, and I'm really going to paint as quickly as I can. This is actually really late, and I want to get this video done, but you guys pretty much get the point, so I'm just going to paint all of it blue. Not a bad color for a snowflake. And after I do the first coat, I will go back over with the second. So we are all done. Snowflake is painted nice and blue. I did two coats. And so now I am adding little details just to make the snowflake more lively. And I didn't want to waste the white paint, so I might as well add dots, of course. Dots is like the easiest thing when you want to decorate something. So I added dots. Like I said, just so I don't waste the white paint, but just to kind of give you guys some creative ideas on what you can do with it. Um, you know, any colors really it could be. I'm, I'm just thinking for me, snowflakes, dark blue, light blue, and white. And then uh, just for Christmas, the glitter can be variety of golds from light to dark. Yep. Decided to add some dots. Then I wanted to get even more creative. Mm-hmm. Because mm -hmm, mm -hmm, Ashley just has to be extra. Uh-huh. I decided to try to attempt to do zigzags instead of dots on some of the sides of my snowflake. So they're not bad. You really can do anything with it. And it doesn't take long at all. This is very a quick, simple activity. You can put it up somewhere in your home. You can do it with kids if you work with kids um, during the winter break. If you're a teacher or an instructor or you work anywhere with kids. This is just a fun craft to do. Even when you're bored sitting at home or you want to do it with your cousins or families. Um, really simple craft. And I feel like it always turns out great. No matter if the star is lopsided or not. No matter if your decorations look like trash. I feel like it, it just always turns out great. This is my favorite season of the year. Time to glitterify the snowflake which colors am I gonna use and I just got this glitter from Dollar Tree so very affordable art project here we go oh, oh oh okay okay oh oh my god wow you really didn't think this through did you mm. wow a lot of glitter Glitter everywhere. Glitter literally gets everywhere. Okay, 
not bad, not bad. The glitter adds something. A little bit of something. Yeah, let's get up close view. Okay. Alrighty, yeah. Show your stuff, snowflake. All right, put that hand down. This is not a makeup tutorial. Come on. Yeah, yeah. Put the hand down. Wrong kind of video. Wrong kind of video, Ashley. All right. What's next? Hmm. Oh, more glitter. Oh, right. Why didn't I think of that? Because it's too much glitter. Oh, boy. You're going to have a lot of cleaning up to do. Yay, all done. Woo! -hoo. All right, go ahead and hit pause. Yes, on the music. Woo! Yeah, you did it, you did it. Yeah, you did it! Hooray! Do, 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 Dora. All right, show them one last time. Mm hmm there you go. Wow, you actually did amazing for once in your life. Yay, okay. Well, let's show them some other things that you can do with these popsicle sticks. So this is another snowflake that you can make. The one we made had six, but this one has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So you can make an even bigger snowflakes with tiny popsicle six. Show them what else. Or you can make a giant one with bigger popsicle six. Still same concept, just a bigger giant one. All right, okay. Just so extra. Always has to take it in another step. Or, oh, oh. Let's save that one for last. Or you can do it like this. A combination of big and small popsicle sticks. Yeah. With a little extra on the ends. Mm-hmm. Or last but not least, you can just whap out. There you go. A deer. A deer, a female deer, a ray, a driving good and so. But I'm not gonna take credit for this. Actually, one of my, that one of the kids that I work with. Yes, yeah, I'm not gonna lie for you. One of the kids that I work with, he actually made this and he did a really great job. Yay! We're all done. See you later, friends. Remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe for more videos. Bye, guys. Now I'm just awkwardly doing something with my hands because I don't know what to do. Okay. All right. Yeah. Bye. See you later for another video soon. Bye. Just keep waving. Okay. Or not. Goodbye. <laughs>